What's up guys, Joseph Ruckich here, and today, the question of the day is, what are the best supplements for fat burning and fat loss? First off, we need to understand, if your goal is fat loss, you need to be in a calorie deficit. That is the number one, that is the most important thing. If you're not in a calorie deficit, it doesn't matter what fat burning supplements that you are taking, you're not going to lose fat. You must be in a deficit. A deficit basically means being in less calories than what your body burns on a daily basis, and when you are in a deficit of calories, essentially your body is short on energy, your body needs the energy from elsewhere, that elsewhere is your stored body fat because your body fat is essentially just stored calories. You then have your body using those stored calories, using that stored body fat as energy so you can move and you can function. And in the process of doing so, you'll get leaner and leaner and leaner. That is the number one most important thing. So if your diet is not on point and you're not in a calorie deficit, then you shouldn't even be looking for what the best fat burner is. But let's just say you have all that locked down. Now, what is the best fat burner supplements to use? There's not much, and that's the truth. There is a few supplements or ingredients, I would say, that can actually help. And most fat burners on the market pretty much just have those ingredients. And at the end of the day, they don't really extend any more than caffeine, green tea, and you can probably argue L-carnitine. Anything outside of that is not really gonna do much, if anything at all. So most of these fat burners are just those ingredients with a few other things here and there for focus and energy and suppressing your appetite. I'm a big believer in fat burners, and I think people should use fat burners, but I think there are many reasons to use a fat burner rather than just burning fat. First off, yes, a fat burner will help you burn more calories, because of the stimulants, the caffeine, the green tea. It also has L-carnitine, which will help you metabolize your body fat and use that as a source of energy. But another reason that you would use a fat burner is because they have ingredients for focus. They have ingredients for energy. So if you take the fat burner and then you're gonna do your cardio, you've got your energy and you, know, you can do your cardio for longer or maybe you've just got more energy during the day so you're moving more by default. And if you're moving more by default, what happens? You burn more calories. But another benefit to a fat burner is they have appetite suppressing ingredients in there. So it stops you from being as hungry and it stops you from having all these cravings. So it actually helps you adhere to the diet, which at the end of the day is the most important thing. But if we had to rule it down to what are the actual ingredients that work when it comes to fat loss, it's caffeine, it's green tea, and it's arguably L-carnitine. Anything outside of that that is legal is not really going to do anything at all. But first things first, diet on point, then add a fat burner on top of that, and you'll be good to go.